it's already unlocked. Okay. There are children. Is this supposed to look out the window? Probably. Yeah, alright, that got me. Good stuff, good stuff. Alright. Yep, yep. That's nice of you. Okay, note to self, pay attention to windows. And, alright, so I lost track. What the hell was I doing? Whew. I was checking everything. I think the entire first floor is unlocked other than that one passage over in that room over there. So I guess floor two. Oh yeah, that's, that's lovely. Start here. Open. Actually, all floor two's open. Alright. Fuck it. Assume nothing. Hell. Who's to say that these, this key even opens a door I have access to right now? Right? <sighs> okay, every time I walk through this hall, something hits with the window. Hang on, that appears to be what I think it is, isn't it? I might be able to get a better angle out here. <sighs> yeah, that's exactly what I think it is. And I suppose that means go outside and investigate. Child on the swing. Well, she's gone. Do I get a key? Yes, I do. Yeah, let's get inside. Because I keep hearing shit ruffle around the bushes. Alright. Nice key. Okay. Just let's keep running. Nope, 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 nope. I don't want anything to do with whatever the hell's out there. Alright. So, new key. Same plan. Search pattern. I don't hyperventilate. I actually just sort of stop breathing. <laughs> you may notice that where I just like, I have to start taking heavy breaths. It's like, oh yeah, I'm forgetting to breathe. That's how I handle being scared. I just forget to breathe. The exact opposite of what most people end up doing. <laughs> it's like, nope, I'm just gonna hold my breath for the next 20 minutes. Turns out I'm David Blaine. No, it's no door in there. check this one already? Doesn't matter. We'll check it anyway. Okay. So that's the first floor cleared. There's one door on the second floor we need to pay attention to. Well, at least someone cleared up the swords. Somebody could get really hurt on those. Something tells me we're going to the third floor. But, uh, you know. Call it a hunch.
Like I said, I have to also keep in mind the idea that um, the keys that I get, I may not have to use, like, right away. Oh, hey, you chilling out again? Enjoy your night. Enjoy your night, sir. I uh, want no trouble. Batteries, matches, so supply cupboard's loaded with shit. Good to know. <sighs> Should duck. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, lovely. Mannequins. Why did it have to be mannequins? And a key. Very good. Has to be mannequins. Alright. Hi, Dragon Breath. Alright. Okay. So, will I find what I need here? Nope. We start uh, start going down then because we cleared the third floor. Only one locked door on the third floor now. Only one locked door on the second floor and two locked doors on the first floor. If memory is correct, so all right. Found it. Well, hello there. Clowns. Hey, Bozo. What's up? Nice. Yeah, there we go. Alright. Oh, dear. A TV. Noises were Belinda again last night. But this time, I heard them too. I'm actually okay Literally. with clowns. Uh, I totally understand why people are fucking scared shitless of them. I'm okay with clowns. <laughs> I'm okay with clowns. Just, just throwing it out there. I am totally okay with clowns. <laughs> they, they're not particularly scary. Uh, for me at least. I don't know, I, I never experienced a clown in my childhood. Maybe that's why. Never went to a circus or anything. Actually, I'm sure I went to Cirque du Soleil once. But they didn't exactly have clowns there. They just had people doing acrobatics. So... Not exactly uh, an unfriendly clown experience, you know? But yeah, I could totally get why people would be scared to listen to clowns. I have a feeling that I know where I have to go because there's a fucking TV and five bucks says we're going all ring on this bitch and bitch is gonna come out of the TV anyone wanna anyone wanna call that bet <laughs> bitch is gonna go ham out of the TV tonight just just saying hey bozo bozo agrees with me you found the blueprint for the wiki on the house I imagine it's horrifyingly ridiculous Wouldn't matter anyway. Is that like graves there? Like outside the graveyard? That seems weird. Uh, yeah. I have a feeling that mannequins. Why does it always have to be mannequins? Mannequins I do find creepy as fuck. <laughs> oh, hello. No? Nothing? Okay. Like I said, I'm probably just gonna sit around till midnight, turn on all the lights. Because I have a fucking feeling 
I know what the ghost is going to do once it turns to midnight. In fact, I'm pretty certain it'll do it now, because I know where the phones are guiding me. The phone that's ringing is, of course, the one over here. Right? How did I guess the phone rings over here? It was in the main hall, I really can't tell. phone's clearly telling me where to go, so let's follow the phone, shall we? Christ. We have to use phones to call different fucking rooms in this house, I'll say that much. Okay, so the next phone's ringing. Is that upstairs or downstairs? It's upstairs. Okay, so it's not ring tonight. That's gonna totally happen. in here? It's not upstairs, I'm pretty sure. Is it downstairs? If I merge back over here, does the... That phone's ringing. Is it? I don't know. Oh, this phone's ringing. Okay. 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 Well, that took far longer than it should have. Couldn't friggin' echolocate the phones. Even the chat said it was upstairs, so. I don't know. Our skills of echolocation. Not great. What's up, Bozo? What's out of this door? Hey, gotta guess. Seems like this falls pretty easy to follow pattern, so... Ah, there's the other key. Interesting, I got one key from outside, so at some point I had to have gotten the outdoors key. Crows have been circling the house all day. Their cacophony makes it almost unbearable to be outside. Did you really just use the word cacophony? Did you just use the word cacophony, sir? That's a word I haven't heard in a long time. I am impressed with your vocabulary. I, uh, I give you three claps for that, sir. Three claps. Uh, if you look up in the sky, you'll often see them crows. Uh, it's not because thunderstorm tonight. I'm sure the power didn't go out last time there was a thunderstorm. Okay. For f I think the problem with these things is every time I look at them, I keep thinking they're doing this. And then I'm just going, oh fuck, they're weeping angels. This these things get to me far more than they fucking should as a result of fucking Doctor Who, man. <laughs> Alright, let's turn on the uh, lights. Wait, there isn't even a phone in this room. That phone- there also isn't a phone there. Did all the phones in the house just legitimately vanish? Oh, no, okay, the, at least that one's still there. Alright, that's an improvement. Yeah, weeping angels terrify everybody. And if you're not terrified by the weeping angels, you're just lying. <laughs> Oh, man. Mm, guess my ring of protection. Since uh, this is going on YouTube, I don't think people on YouTube have really seen this all that much. The ring bears the Palmyrna Eagle on it. 
I'm trying to get it to actually be illuminated, but uh, that proves tricky. It's now 9 o'clock. Like I said, it's fairly likely we're just going to have to wait for uh, midnight. phone there. Uh, what's the time? I don't know, I can't tell. There'll be a grand chime at midnight though. You can hear throughout the house. It's either 10 or 11 o'clock. Called it! Lights are out. Son of a bitch. I take it that means it's midnight. All right, I have a flashlight. And lightning to guide me, kinda. Okay. Oh no, it's only just 11 now. Great. And we can't see shit, okay. It's cliche, everyone expects them to go out. Yeah. 